7.15 in the morning and I'm making myself eat this granola and drink this tea but today is my first day of work Ooh, I'm so excited I'm kind of nervous but I know it'll be fine I try to meditate I did not do a good job my brain is still thinking about the moving company and how I haven't got my stuff yet if you're new here in this uh, moving to Texas series, I have been dealing with it with the moving company. It's September 26th as I film this and they picked up my stuff September 12th, so I don't know how to do the math. It's been a lot of days. <laughs> anyway, welcome to the video. My name's Heather. I'm 28 years old and I now live in Houston, Texas. Today is my first day as an embryologist, so I will be working in a fertility lab and I'm super excited. Mm. This is what I'm wearing to work. I like partially straightened my hair. It doesn't, I don't think it did anything. Um, I got this outfit from my friend Addie because all my nice clothes are with the movie company that I figured I would have now, but <laughs> whatever. I'm gonna change into scrubs right away anyway, so it's like not that big of a deal. I pretty much just have to wear this for like the picture. God, I actually don't like my hair, but Oh, it's too late. I have to leave. So <laughs> yay. Okay. Wish me luck on my first day. Hey guys. So yesterday ended up being really bad. My first day of work was pretty overwhelming. Not just because it was just a brand new job and new environment and new people, but there's just like some things that happened that to me were red flags, but Today it was taken care of. I guess long story short, someone had harassed someone else by putting tuna and shrimp all over their work area. And I'm like, this is literally my first day and this is happening. I've never seen anything happen like that in a professional setting. And so I'm like, okay, who's the person who did this? Like. Am, are they training me? I need to watch my back at this place. Like, oh my God. But then I went in today and they were fired. <laughs> so like everyone was kind of talking about how like unstable they were and just, yeah. So I'm like, okay, like today was a lot better. I'm pretty much just shadowing some of the other embryologists. Things I'll be learning is like sperm. And then I watch some retrievals, like egg retrievals. And then I watch one of my coworkers do Ipsy today. Oh, the cats are fighting. Ipsy, I C S I, which I don't know what the definition is, but I'll put it right here. But that's pretty much taking a needle with a sperm in it and putting like putting it into the egg. Oh my god, that looks bad. But <laughs> it's like making it's the making of the embryo. It's like IVF essentially. But yeah, so today was a lot better than yesterday. Also the moving situation that's pretty much where I had my breaking point yesterday. So I just like, I wanted to film at first, but then I'm like, I like ended up crying. And I'm like, you know what? I'm not gonna film today. I'm just gonna collect my thoughts, whatever. Deal with it later. So now here we are. I think I decided I'm going to make a full video just telling my whole story with the company I hired to move me from Minnesota to Texas. I'll still like, I think like mention it here and there, but I don't want to bore you guys with details. You know what I mean? But anyway, okay, I've been chatting here for a minute. So I got off work at like two and I think I'm going to go to TJ Maxx and buy some workout clothes because all my workout clothes are with the moving company. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> So I went to Marshall's and then it had a home goods section in with it. So lovely. And then I went to Nordstrom Rap, Rack. Turns out they're like right next to each other and I love both of those places. So that's probably where I'm gonna do the majority of my shopping 
for the whole duration of living in Texas. <laughs> but I'll show you a little haul. But I got this sports bra and I looked it up and I got it in two colors. This like black color and then the brown color. And I just love like how it looks like from the behind. I looked it up because it was just like, it's like really good quality. And it's this company out of Australia. This is the same bra on their site. Wait, $68. And I got it for $17. Awesome. So I'm really happy about that purchase. So I got this set of two little yoga crop tops. They're from like Yogalicious. And they came in a set of two and they were $12. I've bought a set like this before in black and pink and honestly don't sleep on these sets. Like normally I think it's kind of weird to buy clothes like as like a set, but for workout clothes, these are really good. And they're like nice quality too. And then I also bought these shorts. I like don't really like them because they're a little bit big on me, but I really, really needed workout shorts. I don't have one of these like silverware dishes or like organizers, so I bought one of these. I bought these fun noodles. I always love going in the food air, the food section to see what they have. And then last but not least from my Marshalls, mm, I bought this pumpkin chai latte candle and it smells so good. Okay, and then I went to the grocery store. I got eggs, ground turkey. Ooh, I did buy these, I did pick up these bagels. They were like from the bakery and they have little jalapenos in it. I'm excited to try these. And then also I got these kombuchas and I've never heard of this brand, but I'm gonna try it. So I'm gonna go for a run now. It is like 6.30. I'm probably just gonna go for like a two mile run and then come back and make some dinner and then just chill for the rest of the night. Is it focused? Okay, my camera's been having focusing issues like every time I start. Hey guys, been a while. <laughs> I like had a look back on my camera to see the last time I filmed and I think it was like Tuesday. Yeah, I just like didn't feel like filming because I thought my life wasn't too interesting. But today's Friday. I finished my first week of work. <laughs> So far, the job is super cool. I like all my coworkers so far. Everyone's like super talkative, which like I think they have to be just because we're always communicating with each other, which I really like because in my last job, everyone worked so independently. It was really easy to just like put headphones on and never talk to anyone. And that's what like I did a lot. That's what a lot of my coworkers did. So I felt like honestly kind of lonely in my last job. Also my last job, as a clinical lab tech, there was always work and I was hourly. So I worked 10 hour shifts. Yeah, that got really long. And I felt like I could be working on a case for a really long time and putting in all this energy and effort in. And then I would finish and be like, yay, I'm done. But then there's like all these other cancer cases on the shelf. So it's like, my old job, I felt like I was on a hamster wheel, whereas with this job, there's only so much work to be done in a day, and once we're done, we get to go home because I'm salary now. Like, <laughs> I love being salary. Like, literally, I get to the lab around eight, and I'm done around two. I work literally six hours. However, saying that, once I learn this one technique, I don't even know which one it is, then I'll have to come in at 6 a.m but I think that might be like a few months before I do that. That's gonna be rough. <laughs> but then you know what? Then I'll be waking up at 5 a.m. and then I can make a, my 5 a.m. morning routine video on YouTube. <laughs> oh my God, I hate myself. Yeah, but today's Friday. I just bought a ticket to go to Jason Ross and Gem and Tori, they're EDM artists, and I'm going by myself. Cheers to doing things by yourself, you guys. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm doing such a terrible 
job vlogging. I ate some dinner and now I'm ready to go to Jason Ross. Do you like my Odessa shirt? I just got it. It's, except like, okay, this, like the embroidery is like messed up because it's like Ode as, and then uh is like way over here. Like what? <laughs> I don't fucking know. Anyway, this is my fit for the night. I will see you guys at Jason Ross. Bye. <laughs>